to an episode of Daddy Daughter Conversation. It's me and my dad. Dad done. And today we bring to you another hot, exciting video. Video. But before we start, please make sure to like, comment, share, and, and subscribe. 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 And subscribe, subscribe. Subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you don't get to miss any of our video videos once we drop them, them out. out. Thank you and welcome to this. Like Lulu has said, we want to talk to you about, we want to share with you our. Uh, you know, we, we we said here before that we are not perfect, are we? Nope. <laughs> yeah, what we are trying to tell you that this is just a journey of uh, an African dad with uh, uh, an African an African daughter born in Africa being raised in America. <laughs> so we do have our 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 areas that also we work on and so today we just want to share with you a little bit of uh, what we go through uh, just as challenges and of course how we work at them so that you know that uh, this is a normal daddy daughter relationship it will not always be rosy but it is possible for you to work at it and uh, make it work and at least for the better part of it appreciate the bond any relationship that you start out there or you have out there whether it is daddy daughter relationship child parent relationship sibling relationship any kind of relationship you gotta work at it you have to uh, put in the work make sure that you try and understand each other try and appreciate the other person and especially for daddy daughter and parent child is that you have to uh, one person provides a guidance but at least most of the times you communicate and of course find a way on how to guide the other person and especially the child in the way that they need to grow and of course <clears throat> that's our journey so now we want to give you at least uh, some of our challenges that we have had Baby, have we had any challenges yeah yeah i mean we've my daughter is studying right now in turn for in so we've had our moments mm -hmm. <laughs> we've had our moments and of course we still have more to come but always what we say is we have never been here before we are both what learning what are we learning about each other yeah we are learning every time we turn into a year i've never been a dad to her 13 year old and you've never been 13. Have you been 13 before? Nope. Maybe you know what you're supposed to be doing there. You have no idea. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. So what are some of the challenges that you think we, we have encountered and uh, probably challenges and you said opportunities? Yeah. Sometimes you make me do stuff that I don't want to do. Yeah. Sometimes, uh, of course, um, uh, and that that will happen mostly like uh, she makes me do things that at times I don't want to do. <laughs> there are times we have to go out of our way for each other. Uh, you know, like uh, in a relationship, you have to find sometimes you got to go out of your way for the other person. She probably feels that uh, there are things that she doesn't have to do. For example, there are times she just feels like it's time to sleep. But I am allowing her to sleep because there's something that we need to do, you know, so she got to wake up. <laughs> I have to because I have school coming up and even if I don't, I have to get my grades up high. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so. mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's normal, you know, the body, the, the mind tells you that uh, the best way to do is relax and sleep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we just want to sleep. We just have to want probably to rest because that's what is... Uh, so I, I have to, we have to agree, come, follow the timetable, like you wake up and you have to do certain things on Sunday because uh, the school work still, it's not yet a holiday. So maybe until summer, uh, maybe when someone is able to uh, to sleep in longer, they are disappointed. But one of the things that we do, and the opportunity comes in when you have to talk about it, apologies, 
and appreciate that yes, these moments will come. Forgive yourself, don't remain in the part that you are, uh, oh, I'm this bad, oh, I've forgotten, oh, this, this, so it becomes like now. Yeah. Do you know that famous basketball player, Michael Jordan? Mm-hmm. He got cut out of his team when he was in middle school. Mm-hmm. So imagine if he had stayed on that cut. Awesome. Yeah, that's a very a very good example. You see, yeah, some of the greatest people have gone through a challenge, but they have risen above it. So even us, we have our imperfections, but you don't remain in your imperfections. Focus on the part of your relationship that is working. We have our challenges, as you have heard, but one thing we have learned, it is what makes us. <laughs> Nobody remembers the people who gave up. Awesome. Nobody will ever remember you if you give up. Nobody will remember the relationship if you don't talk about it. That's what makes us. And so go out there, make the relationships work. Don't expect people to be perfect. Because we ain't. We ain't either. Teenagers. Don't expect your parents to be perfect. Parents, don't expect your teenagers to be perfect. I think that idea could have got out the window by now. Yeah, we shouldn't expect them to be perfect. Don't expect us to be perfect. Because we ain't. Because we ain't. We're just growing together. Yeah. I think that's it for our video today. We have uh, opened you up into a bit of us and uh, we hope to see you in our next one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, baby. But before we end this, we're going to... Okay. Two yeah. signs subscribe. Are you ready? One, one two. two. Thank, Thank you, you so much, much for subscribing. See you in our next one. Au revoir.